Hello there, it is I, the Geordie Nerd, and I am back again with another episode of The Good Place. In the last episode, Eleanor said she was in the wrong place. She was in, she's supposed to be in the bad place. Um, so yeah, I'm excited to see where this goes. Really excited. Like every episode ends on a cliffhanger and I'm just like, no! <laughs> if you'd like to see the full unedited reaction for this video, the link will be down below. Uh, for the Patreon, also Twitch and Twitter and Facebook, just to keep you up to date with all my videos and if I do some live streams. Um, so yeah, let's just get into this now and have some fun. Who are you? Well, my name is Eleanor Shellstrop, and some of the info you had was right. I mean, flattened by boner pill truck after <laughs> dropping margarita mix in grocery store parking lot. That's a very me way to die. But all the other info was wrong. In my defense, when I first arrived and you said, you, Eleanor Shellstrop, are dead and you're in the good place, I had no reason to think that was a mistake. Really? Really, Eleanor? Really? Janet. What's that? <laughs> What's that? What's this? Anything else? No, Janet, this is actually a, a cactus. <laughs> This might take a while. <laughs> well, that could be a file you don't know. This is the good place. Anything could be anything. You kicked a dog into the sun, dude. Question number one. Did you ever wrongfully slaughter your kinsman's yak? <laughs> oh, sorry. This is the nomadic Mongolian edition. I need to grab the... Just go off that one. She'll get into the good place, because I'm pretty sure she didn't slaughter a yak. Were you ever a waiter? And when seeing a customer who had eaten all his or her food, you said sarcastically, guess you hated it? No. <laughs> Again, no, I could be in the good place. You will spend eternity with murderers and arsonists and people who take off their shoes and socks on commercial airlines. <laughs> Janet, can I have a glass of water, please? Wait a minute. Do people actually take that? I've never been on a plane before. Never been abroad. So, yeah, I'm poor. Um, do people take their socks and shoes off on an aeroplane? And finally, a multi-part question. Did you ever appear on the American television program, The Bachelor, or its companion shows, The Bachelorette and Bachelor in Paradise, or work on them no. in any capacity, or post on any social media site that you were emotionally invested in any of the relationships <laughs> the contestants were pursuing? No. No. So if that's the case, shouldn't she have went to the good place anyway then? If she's... I mean, I mean, assuming we've missed a couple of hundred questions. But I've never seen The Bachelor or been on it, so I could go to the good place. Is it actually a cactus? I don't understand. I want to see the file for Eleanor Shellstrop. Is that what you have, or do you have a cactus? I have the file. You're sure? You have the file and, and, and not a cactus? That is correct. I have Eleanor Shellstrop's file. I do not have a cactus. Excellent. Please, give me the file. Here you go. <laughs> Thank you, Jack. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, God. Oh. Maybe that is the file, though. This is terrible. What am I supposed to do if you ask me? I don't know. Kant would say that... Lying in any scenario is wrong. So if Michael asks you if you killed Janet, you should say yes. On the other hand, snitches do get stitches. That is true. <laughs> I read that once on the back of my boy Peanuts tricep. Are you just... So either way, you're forked in the ash. That's what she's trying to say, really. Is her staying here unfair to those who earned their place? It sounds like you want her to leave. Well, is it not she who wants us to leave her? Thank you, Tahani. You've been a big help. <laughs> <laughs> so, the cube of lies and truth works on Michael, too. Chidi, come on in. Hi there. I have Eleanor's file. Janet, if you hand me a cactus, I swear I will lose my mind. <laughs> oh! Oh! It's a file! Yes. All right, here we go. Eleanor, come back in. Chidi, you stay here. This file contains a list of every good and bad thing you ever did. I really, really wish it hadn't been a file. 
she could have give Cactus's what, cacti, Cac whatever, to make all this whole episode, and I would have loved it. Your entire life told through a compendium of all of your actions. Nope, it's a picture of a cactus. <laughs> Dozens and dozens and dozens of pictures of the same cactus. Oh. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, Janet. Oh, Janet. Oh. I just love you, Janet. That's all I can say on the matter. I'll tell you, and I'm going to be 100% honest, but it doesn't make me look great, so don't judge me. That's literally the purpose of this entire <laughs> exercise. Come on, you knew that, right? Um, I have to go to this stupid work party tonight. Can I borrow your peach dress? Oh, it's a hard no, babe. That dress is like twice your salary. All right, I gotta go to the DMV and pick up my vanity plates. Ciao, bitches. Well, she's not getting in the good place either. Mm. The dress bitch is so catchy. Yeah. I mean, someone could totally make t-shirts. <laughs> oh. <No. laughs> yes, Michael. She did. No, no, no. I can't believe you sold the t-shirts. Does it help if they basically sold themselves? I think you know it does not. What did you do with the money? Thanks, babe. Wow, $980 on a dress. Christ. That is insane. What's the most expensive thing you've ever bought? Put in the comments down below. No judgment from me. I don't, I don't care. If you've got a million pound in the bank, that's ex excellent. You spent a million pound on a car. Cool. If you don't, whatever. The most expensive thing I've ever bought outright is my Xbox Series X. Dude, you're like a legend in the bad place. You're, check this out. Huh? It's pretty great, right? Trevor, do you know what caused this mistake? Because I cannot figure it out. No, we're stumped. But uh, don't sweat it, champ. She's definitely one of ours. So we'll just roll on out, and you can get back to uh, putting rainbows up your butt or whatever you do here. <laughs> That's Adam Scott, I think his name is. And he does play a scumbag well. Like, you really do want to punch the guy in the face. Genuinely. I mean, obviously not the the... the, the the real person but the the characters he plays you want to punch in the face just just to clarify just in case somebody tells adam scott i want to punch him in the face because <laughs> i don't good good actor <laughs> not that i want to punch bad actors in the face we'll just move on there should be a medium place for people like me who kind of sucked but in like a fun chill way i agree i'm sorry there isn't i'm sorry i dragged you into this and that I never did laundry. And that I waited until you were about to do yours, then secretly tossed mine into the basket to trick you into doing it. You didn't trick me. I repeatedly asked you to stop. Just know, you did everything you could to help me. The medium place. I think a medium place would be everything's just okay. Like, you, you can watch a movie, but it's on a VCR. The tape has got ten minutes missing. And it and it and it's like really bad quality. Eleanor, come on out. Hi everyone, I'm Eleanor Shellstrop. No, oh my god, she's being tortured in the bad place. That's horrible, man. Well, oh my god, I don't like this at all. Holy crap, man! Stop with the cliffhangers. <laughs> Oh my god, this show is so intense. It's hilarious. You feel like you learn something at the same time. And also it leaves on a cliffhanger. And I hate I hate that. I hate I, I hate it. I really do. I want to know what's going on. And to do that, I've got to continue watching it. Oh my good lord. First off, I just want to say thank you to everybody who comes out and watches these. I understand it's a six-year-old show now, maybe, I don't know. I'm pretty sure it's finished, um, so I appreciate the people who do come out and watch it. I really, really do. Um, if you watch this and you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe. I'm going to finish this show for, for real. I love it. I'm, I'm hooked, and I want to watch it more and more. Uh, this episode was great. I love Janet and the fact that she keeps giving him uh, cactus, cacti, whatever. And then when, he give her, when she give him the file... And it was all pictures of cactus, cacti, whatever. 
Um, just, just brilliant. I love Janet. I love Jason. Gian Yu. Um, Chidi is he's grown on us. He really is like the the guy give himself up to help protect Eleanor, and then they hit you with that at the end. That poor woman who deserves to be in the good place has been tortured the whole time. Eleanor has the other Eleanor has been in the good place, and that is just horrible. But I cannot wait to continue it. Thank you very much for coming out to watch these. Like I said. Drop a like, subscribe, share and all that stuff and I'll see you all again very soon for more The Good Place reaction videos.